morning everyone it is nail friday and um i'm gonna be honest my day got off to a really bad start because this one this is her new thing that she learned from her cousin that to hide under the bed when she's doing something naughty hey is this what you do so she woke up and kyle let her into our bed and then about half an hour later around 7 30 um like i didn't have to get up today so i wasn't planning on getting up till like much later, she got up because she needed to go to the washroom, so she went and rang her bell. And then it, I was like, okay, I'll take her out because Kyle actually has to get up for work or whatever. So I'll just take her out quick and let her back in. And normally in the morning, she's really good. She just goes to the washroom really fast. So I didn't put her on her leash. And so she went pee, and then she just took off running down the street. And I had gone out in flip-flops, my pajamas, like pajama shorts and it's February so it's cold outside and so flip-flops pajama shorts and Kyle's jacket and um, she took off running so now I'm running down the street literally crying because I was like she's gonna run away and like get hit by a car or something so I'm literally like bawling chasing after her I'm like Shelby stop and she just wouldn't stop she wouldn't come and so um, luckily she had to go poop and so she went to find a spot to poop and I picked her up as she was pooping which then got poop all over me I didn't want her to wait for her to finish because I was scared that she would just keep running I did get her but we're not on good terms this morning that was the start of my day so then I came back and I was so grumpy and I just like came back and Kyle was obviously still sleeping and I was like did you not hear me screaming and he was like what no and I was like I was literally screaming outside the window as I ran down the street chasing after our dog and I was like so upset and I was just so mad that he was like still asleep and I'm sure like obviously it wasn't a nice wake up for him so I'm gonna go get ready for my day uh do my makeup and just get ready and I will be ready in three two and I'm back. Okay, so I am now ready for the day. Um, today, I don't have too much planned. I have um, some cooking I want to do. Um, we're having like a soup for dinner, so I need to make that. And then Kyle and I thought it would be fun to just like make a cheesecake or something. <laughs> we were just saw a recipe and we're like, we should make that. So I'm going to do that today. Um, but other than that, I don't have a whole lot. My sister-in-law is gone for the day and so she's just asked if I could watch uh, Luna, their puppy. And so Luna and Chevy are upstairs playing right now. Um, other than that, yeah, not too much happening today. What do you guys think of my eye makeup today? It's much, they're so loud. It's much darker than I normally wear, but what do you guys think? I'm kind of into it. I kind of like it a lot. It's from the um, just peachy, or the, what is that called? Yeah, just peachy mattes by Too Faced, and so I'm in love with that palette. But anyways, what do you guys think of this look? Let me know in the comments down below. I wanted to show you guys this candle that I, or Kyle and I have. Um, Kyle, like his company, they make stock video and stuff like that. And I think someone saw their video or like someone like that buys stuff from their company or whatever um, was like, hey, I'd love to send you guys some bath bombs so that way uh, you guys can make a video using those. Like they make abstract like stock video and stuff like that. You guys can check that out at storytape.com. So they were going to send them all these bath bombs and they're like, I'd love to send all your employees um, the candles as well. And so they each got to pick out a scent that they wanted. And so Kyle picked out Pina Colada. So it's by this company called The Wax Kitchen. I believe it's a soy candle, and so it's just in this really cute jar. I'm actually almost all out of it, but it smells so good. You guys should check out their website. They sell some really cool products and stuff. So I just finished making dinner. It's only two in the afternoon, but uh, it'll be ready whenever we want to eat. I made a broccoli cheese soup. It looks really green. <laughs> I put so much broccoli in it. Um, now I'm going to make this cheesecake that Kyle and I saw on Pinterest and we want to make. Look at how good this looks. Triple chocolate cheesecake with Oreo crust. Like, mmm. Also, I've made like a huge mess. Look at <laughs> my kitchen. There's like dishes everywhere. Kyle always says like I make a giant mess when I'm cleaning or when I cook or when I bake anything. But like, it's not true. Like, yeah, I make a mess, but I always clean it up. It's not like I just leave it a mess. Whereas like... 
my one sister, she would always cook and then she'd make like a huge mess. There'd be dishes everywhere in the kitchen and then she'd just never clean it up. Like at least I'd clean up my mess. But comment down below, are you someone that cleans up as you go when you're like baking or cooking or something? Or do you just like leave it all till the end and you have this giant mess or do you just leave the mess and make someone else clean it up? Comment down below with what you are, like which one you are. I feel like you haven't been in a vlog so long, babe. Where have you been? I'm busy. Busy doing what? It's a secret. Why are you never here? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I just never film when you're here, that's all. Hobby Lobby. Ooh, we should go to the States. We're not going to Hobby Lobby. There's nothing well, we don't have there. to go to Hobby Lobby. I'm just saying we should go to the States. You do what? Go shopping. You need to go shopping though. I know. I am, I'm on a no spending thing and it's killing me slowly. Um, I am actually excited to go back to the gym. As much as I'm not really feeling motivated, um, I have been trying really hard to go to the gym lots in February and I've done really, really well. Um, so those two days off were actually kind of nice. My body was feeling really tired and I was just like really exhausted. I was kind of feeling like just discouraged and stuff from going. And so taking two days off was good, but then you have to go back and just keep going. You can't just sit there and, and not go. So we just finished at the gym and it was a good workout. Kyle said his was like really tough. Right? Um, and then mine was really good, but I do this. I don't know what it's called. It's like this adaptive movement trainer or something. It's like kind of like an elliptical, but I don't know, way harder. And I finished off my workout with that because you burn so many calories on it. And I just like, oh, I feel like dead. Like that thing just kills me. Oh my gosh. What are you doing? Okay, I, uh, <laughs> this person is an on and on ramp. What are they doing? They're on an on ramp onto the highway and they just started reversing. You can't just <laughs> I can't believe they kept backing up. As if I got that on video. <laughs> Honestly, I see the stupidest driving things in Niagara Falls. Anyways, they were going onto the on ramp, onto a highway, and they just stopped and were reversing, and we were approaching the on ramp, and they just kept backing up towards us. Who does that? Anyways, it was a really good workout. I just like I'm so sweaty and so warm right now from that machine. I'm excited to eat dinner. I'm hungry now. I hope it's good. It's not good. Yeah, I think it's good. 